what's 73? 100 minus 73? 27. 27. <laughs> Next up, the old favourites. Oh, they just got those down easy. The Rafa Classic Bibs. Now, one thing you will notice with these bibs is the colour. I have very much gone for blue. I used to be the black bib kind of guy until recently, and then I swapped over to blue, which is quite, quite like the blue. Anyway, there we are. Bit of classic bibs. Luxurious Lycra. It does feel a little nicer. Not quite as thick compared to the core. Again, you get that close but relaxed regular raffa fit and again large these ones are in my standard size i've got no issues with the sizing on these now an interesting thing is raffa classics are the ones i've had for quite a few years now but these are i think a new design here as if by magic some i prepared earlier the old classic range and uh yeah they're a little bit different i think a little bit in design but certainly on the leg ripper side you can see that the leg rippers have changed quite a bit over there that is the old one compared to the new. Back on the new ones. Now these are, I think, maybe I'm making it up, we'll see in the fit. The waistband, I much prefer the waistband on these. It seems a lower cut, doesn't ride up so high, but we'll see if that's just my imagination when we get them tried on. Material-wise, I said, that Lycra fabric and key thing these days, it's got recycled fibers in them. A lightweight, high stretch, a little bit more breathability in these. Up on the uppers, you've got this whole, what do we call this? Mesh. Yes. Mesh. Unlike the core. Unlike the core, who had no meshing, we've got some holes in here. So for a little bit more breathability, you've got that. Main part of it, that's 58% uh, recycled nylon, 42% elastane, so more elastane in the classics compared to the core. And the contrast, which I'm assuming is this bit on here, and the mesh part, 73% recycled nylon, 42%. That's not right, is it? Because I know that doesn't add up to 100%. What's 73? 100 minus 73? 27. 27. <laughs> 27%. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't, don't start doing any mathematics uh, <laughs> vlogging, kid. Oh, this was going to be, I was going to kind of drum roll a little bit of guess where. You've already said it though. Made in Portugal. Portugal. My, my next residency, my next home, where I'm going to move to, where the sun always shines maybe, and they have an AU passport still. Breathability factors, so we've already talked about the mesh uppers. Chamois, as we looked at, so same as in the core. Rafa Classic, it is the classic chamois. A size specific pad, so depending on what size bib shorts you'll get, you'll get an appropriate size pad in there. And something they talk about on this, which I've never kind of really seen, but an antibacterial top sheet. I can't see that in there myself, but I'm sure that lovely luxurious top seat has some antibacterial properties about it. Graphics wise, similar to the core, you've got the two classic wrapper leg logos. Nothing else though on the back. You do have a nice little tag there, just in case you're wondering who it is. You've got a little wrapper tag there. Something that I've always seen, never used. You ever, you ever use this little, little back pocket? I have no idea what I would even put in there. It's called a key pocket. It's not going to stay in there then, is it? So we put your car key. <laughs> yeah, put something in there. Leg grippers though on these, they're interesting. So they seem to have a separate bit of material which is actually sewn on to the main leg of the bibs. So nice and secure leg grippers. Quite thick, very uh, tactile, very, very sticky. That is your yeah, Rafa classic bib short. Rafa classics, my go-to bib short. Nice fit. You just feel the like was a little, little more luxurious compared to the cores. Slightly thinner. Lengthwise, I think these are pretty similar to, to the cores. I must have had these on uh, the old, uh, the old leg, a little bit of gapping though in the, uh, yeah. Yeah, in the, in the, in the grippers. Doesn't seem quite as tightly fitted around. Maybe I just need bigger legs. Need to get working out more. But other than that fit, they feel they feel good. Not too compressive. Don't feel it too much. I do feel the grippers. Again, it just seems they kind of uh, don't quite touch everywhere, in every place. We've got the old mesh straps, so a little bit of breathability around there. Got the big back cutout, and we've got our magic pocket, which I've never used before. 
gel and I'll, I'll use it now. Pad, classic pad, same as the cores. Never had an issue with that really. Now the big test, the waistband, the belly button test. See, the cores were, were up around here. You can see I've got big cut out, it's almost, you know, that kind of mankini fit that I'm, I like to uh, to wear. So you're in position, doesn't ride up as much, doesn't feel like you are restricted, contained. Just on that, those leg grippers, I mean, they, again, they, they've made them much larger on the new classics, but for me, maybe again, I don't think it's, I've got that skinny legs. They just don't quite grip around the hole. You know, I can get my finger in them. I mean, that's a, I've, not, I've not really had an issue with them. It doesn't cause me an issue on the bike, but you do, when you're thinking about it, you do notice that they're not skin tight. You can get a little... They're not gripping the leg as close as uh, the others. Yeah, overall, I quite like these. Don't, I've never really noticed that as an issue. Rafa Classics.